Hi Brett, this is um, my response to your U2 early singles uh, upload that you did recently. Just thought um, I'd share my my first uh, few singles from U2. These are all UK pressings. Um, great band. I was madly into them, and um, watching your video made me want to pull mine and listen to them. So here we go, and uh, you'll see some familiarity with. Uh, with some of yours. So, um, U23, with the, uh, as you said, with the um, names of the, of the members of the band and what they play on the back, uh, really early pictures, grotty printing as well. This is on CBS UK. So it's the, um, the yellow and orange uh, label with U-2 as the name. So uh, on side A, it's out of control. Um, what does it say on anything specific? No, not really. Uh, on the other side is Stories for Boys and Boy Girl, uh, manufactured in Ireland. So it's the Irish, as you call it, the Irish copy. But we, it was the UK copy also. Uh, number two in my list is uh, Eleven O'clock TikTok. Same as yours once again. Um, this is the. UK version, so 11 o'clock TikTok on one side, um, recorded by the great Martin Hammack as well, yeah, so there you go, it's got the um, the two-tone CBS label, and then on the flip side, it's got Touch, um, great single, I actually really like Touch, so very pleased to have that one, uh, moving on, I will follow and uh, this has got uh, Boy Girl live at the Marquee, which is the London Marquee. Uh, and I was actually at that gig, so um, this has a special sort of uh, special memories for me. This one, um, absolutely fabulous, produced by Steve Lily White, uh, who went on to great things with the band and beyond. U um, hyphen two again, got the boy on the cover, just like the uh, the album, and then. Last of my seven-inch uh, U2 collection is uh, U2 New Year's Day, and it says here from the forthcoming album War, produced by Steve Lily White. And on the flip side, it's uh, Side Two Treasure. Whatever happened to Pete the Chop? And once again, that's on um, that's on the CBS label. But now U2 doesn't have the hyphenated U2. Um, anything special on there? Let's have a look. Uh, Windmill Lane Studios in Dublin, which they used uh, throughout that 80s period. Um, yeah, uh, made by Island Records, but on CBS label. And on the flip side, Treasure, whatever happened to Pete the Chop, another non non album single. So, um, there we have it. While you were listening to your ones, I was clearly listening to mine. So, uh, Great stuff, and um, hope you like the video.